Thank you for joining us here at 4 o'clock. More police are still looking for answers in a deadly shooting from Sunday night. Police say the victim, a 19-year-old, crashed into a power pole after being shot. News 9's Brittany Tulis is talking with neighbors who say they are still on edge. Neighbors I talked to say Sunday they heard three sounds in quick succession. First gunshots, then a loud crash, and an eerie horn that wouldn't turn off. Oh, it was a tornado siren but realized it wasn't making the up and down sound. And Instead, that sound coming from a car that crashed into a power pole on Santa Fe Avenue. The neighbor says at the time, she didn't know the severity of the accident. The fire trucks were here like immediately. It was really fast because I could see all the lights and I, I instantly ran out the front door. And I thought maybe the guy was racing down the road like anybody else. I didn't put the gunshots in that together at the time. It only took seconds for her to realize it was more than a car crash. The ambulance, they were in a rush to get him out of there. It was just, that kind of hit me hard. I was like, oh no. And when I found out he was my kid's age, it, it really hurt. <laughs> I was like, oh, that could, you know, could have been my kid. More police say the victim is 19-year-old Raul Friere Valdenvinos. Police say he was shot in the chest before crashing into the power pole. Investigators are still looking for the person who pulled the trigger. The lights, I can see them going through my window all night long. And I, I didn't sleep very well. It was not good because I just kept going through my mind thinking about what I heard and how that was the shots that took his life. If you have any information on the killing, call the Moore Police Department. In Moore, Brittany Tulis, Oklahoma Zone, News 9. Hopefully, the